Hey guys, welcome back to Vito's Garage. Thank you so much for watching and tuning in. And today we're gonna to be uh, doing a quick review video of this uh, Testman multimeter. Uh, it's a really cute little uh, multimeter that I really wanna test out. And we're gonna use it on this uh, uh, newer GMC uh, car. And we're gonna see uh, how it works and all that. And I'm really curious myself as well. And this is actually pretty handy. And we're gonna see what's inside of this box. Uh, and yeah, let's get to it. I'm just so eager to test this thing out. And it's really nice it actually comes with this uh packaging and you know i really like the colors that they chose for this particular one and um, as you can see inside there's a baggie uh, that's where the multimeter is and the leads and everything else uh, and then uh, actually really like this uh, you know little user manual that they included and um, uh, they have uh, different language um, options to english and all the other stuff but yeah uh that's cool i really want to go ahead and test it out i uh, really like this thing so here's the little uh, baggie and we're about to open it up and see what's inside of it uh, i'm really curious upon uh, opening it up as you can see we have this little multimeter which is really cool you can test voltages uh with it you can test ohms and actually you can test uh, uh much of other stuff i think that this is also good for testing like that uh, in-house uh, electricity and all that stuff too uh, and you know it comes with two batteries right here and two uh, leads as well it's really cool all right you just plug it in uh, plug both of those in but it's really really handy it's really like it even will fit in my pocket most likely yeah it's just really tiny and handy tool to have so here's the little tester uh, that i took out of this uh packaging and this uh green part is actually like uh like a cover for it so you can peel it and once you peel that uh, you'll be able to actually install the batteries in that thing yeah you just need a tiny screwdriver to open that up and install those two batteries that are supplied with the kit so we're gonna open this up after opening the cover go ahead and install your batteries already have the action right there look at that and install your cover with the screw now grab your black and red leads black goes to the com port and red goes to this red one you can't miss that all right and now with this multimeter uh literally just turn it on right here and then as you can see there's an arrow right there so you can actually go in between and you can choose whichever you want it actually also has a light in the back right there which is super cool so if you're working in the dark that will actually help a lot and uh, literally if you're just somewhere stranded you don't know where your battery is or your voltage of the battery is you can literally like have this thing handy and you know there's the battery right there and you have this little tool that will help you out with you know testing your charging voltage or just a, a regular battery voltage you know, when the car is off and you can test voltage drops you can test a lot of other things and resistance of the sensors and all that's pretty handy you know and um yeah we're gonna go ahead try this out Another cool thing about this uh, little tool is that you don't actually have to choose anything. As you can see, it's jumping right in between all the voltage, the ohms and all that. So if you're testing the battery voltage, let's say, right? So we're going to put negative lead on the negative terminal and then the positive on the positive right there. Okay. And as you can see, it's automatically uh, choosing the voltage right there, 12.55 volts, which is really, really cool. We're about to start the car and see what it's showing once the car is started. All right, let's go ahead and start this crazy new car. All right, so now we're gonna try and test charging voltage. All right, so it seems like maybe my connection is like a little bit bad because I got to press this thing in there. Let's see, I try again. And there you go, it's your charging voltage right there. Yep, awesome. Uh, so it's pretty handy, a little tool, and I'm definitely gonna be using it a lot on my cars, especially if I'm going like a road tripping or something like that, it's pretty handy. You can even put it in the glove box in this little baggie, and it's super, super awesome. And like I said, you can test a bunch of other stuff. You can even test your, like I said, like your sensors, 
like in a lot of uh, old school cars that we know guys like the crankshaft position sensor or some other sensors like even on this car it doesn't matter what car you have there's a bunch of sensors in the car and you can test the resistance on them and uh, you know and you will be able actually to see how much um, how many ohms it shows and whether the sensor is shorted out or whether the sensor is just open and not good so this is a really handy little tool uh, definitely going to be using it definitely recommend this thing and there's gonna be a lot of uh um you know links and resources in the description for you guys to check out this little tool so um yeah go ahead check it out and let me know what you guys think of this toolkit yourself so let's say you're testing you're trying to test the um fuses to make sure the fuses are good so instead of you having to pull the fuse out you can actually go ahead and um I'll show you how to take this guy out and the cover for the fuse box. Okay, and actually, you can literally grab your multimeter. Right, turn this on, and you can literally put the multimeter across the two terminals, two pins of the fuse. Uh, we're going to try to see if I can do it, and that will actually show you. So this multimeter uh, is actually really cool in this case. Let's see, Let's see if I can do it one-handed. All right, I finally got it um, on two pins of that fuse. As you can see, it's beeping and it's showing that it's good. So pretty amazing little tool, gotta tell you that. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Thanks so much for watching and tuning in. And don't forget to uh, look at those links down in the description box. There's going to be a lot of info uh, down there on this little toolkit. I'm super happy to have one of these tools with me. It's going to be really, really helpful uh, for me to have one of these just to help me out with a lot of, you know, electrical stuff on cars and diagnosing that. So super ha happy to have one of these. It's super handy little tool. And yeah, just let me know what you guys think of this tool yourself once you get it. It would be... Um, Great, greatly appreciate it you know um but yeah i just really really like this thing it literally fits it's just super compact size that it just fits literally like in your pocket in the glove box anywhere it doesn't take up so much space so yeah anyways guys thanks so much for watching and tuning in i'll see you in the next one take care